This is a true story. This one. to sell me four wheels and a trunk. I said, man, there ain't no engine. He said, engine's just some kind of junk. You don't need no engine to go downhill. And I can plainly see that that's the direction you're headed in. And he handed me the keys. I said, no. that stuff to me Ah, oh, no deal I'm going back to Tennessee Well, I went to a doctor of the highest order He said I couldn't have a drink for a year Well, one glass of wine on my birthday If my birthday wasn't too very near Well, he must have put me in a state of shock I made it for about two weeks. And he sent me a bill, knocked me flat off the wagon, friends, back down on my feet. Well, I said, no, deal. You can't sell that stuff to me. Ah, oh, no, deal. I'm going back to Tennessee. Well, when true love knocked on my door she just barely turned 16 I was a little bit nervous if you know just what I mean but I'd heard somewhere that true love conquers all and I figured that was that until I started having dreams about being run out of town wearing nothing but my cowboy hat and I said no Sell that stuff to me. Ah, oh, no, deal. I'm going back to Tennessee. Well, I've come through this life of stumbler, friends, and I expect to die that way. Oh, it could be 20 years from now. It could be most any day. But if there ain't no whiskey and women, Lord, behind them heavenly doors, I'm gonna take my chances down below of that you can be sure. Well, it's no deal. You can't sell that stuff to me. Ah, no deal. I'm going back to Tennessee. And it's no, no deal. You can't sell that stuff to me. Well, it's no deal. I'm going back to Tennessee. What a song. Well, play one more and then maybe put on a some. Some Towns Van Zandt records, maybe. This is WBAI in New York City, and that's Towns Van Zandt. I wouldn't tell it if it wasn't a true story. Because it sure ain't a funny story. <laughs>
Central Central Won't you please give me two on that Hello, hello Central Won't you please give me two on that Talk to my baby. She's so far down the line. Seem like the buses don't stop running, and the trains don't allow me to ride no more. Well, the buses done stop running And the trains don't allow me to ride no more Ticket agent said my ticket's played out You see, I don't ride for sure Well, I turned away from the telephone yeah, and I ran back home. I turned away from the telephone yeah, and I ran back home. I fell down on my knees No operator in this world Gonna tell me what I've been doing wrong Hello Central Won't you please give me two nights Ah oh, hello 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 Won't you please give me two I just want to talk to my baby She's so far down the line I wrote this song in only on New York. Almost burned 
turned out my eyes. I threw my ears down to the floor. I didn't see nothing. And I didn't hear nothing. I stood there like a block of stone, knowing all I had to know, and nothing more. And friends, that's nothing. troubles are locked in each other's arms and you better pray that they never find you cause your back ain't strong enough for burdens double fold they'd crush you down down into nothing Being born is going blind and bowing down a thousand times. The echoes strum on pure temptation. Sorrow and solitude, these are the precious things and the only words that are worth remembering. stronger wind than the one that blows down along some railroad line. No prettier sight than looking back on a town you left behind. But there's nothing that's as real as the love that's in my mind. I'll close your eyes, I'll be here in the morning close your eyes I'll be here for a while well, there's lots of things along the road that I'd surely like to see well I'd like to lean into the wind to tell myself I'm free your softest whispers louder than the highways call to me. I'll close your eyes, I'll be here in the morning. Close your eyes, I'll be here for a while. All the mountains and the rivers and the valleys can't compare to your bluely dancing eyes and yellow shining hair. Well, I could never hit the open road and leave you lying there. I'll close your eyes, I'll be here in the morning. Close your eyes, I'll be here for a while. I'll lay your head back easy, love. Close your crying eyes. Well, I'll be laying here beside you when the sun comes on the rise. I'll stay as long as the cuckoo wails and the lonesome blue jay cries. I'll 
close your eyes, I'll be here in the morning. Close your eyes, I'll be here for a while. Or close your eyes, I'll be here for a while. the song out right directly after having read the uh, uh, St. Francis by Cousin Sock. In Wilmington, Delaware or somewhere. voice will be Gretchen, but uh, you probably won't. Well, I spent the first half of the summer in uh, L.A. making that record, and uh, L.A. seems to me to be almost uninhabitable. It's so, it's so uh, smoggy. It's, it's just oppressive. It's so smoggy. But then I spent the second half of the summer in uh, Aspen, Colorado, training horses and, and uh, taking pack trips into the mountains and stuff like that. But maybe that's the same as spending the summer in a vacuum. <laughs> Never mind. It would be too hard to explain what I was trying to say. <laughs> Oh. 
farther along We'll understand why So cheer up my brothers And live in the sunshine We'll understand it all by and by Well tempted and tried, Lord And off me to wonder Why it should be thus all the day long Or oh, while there are others Living among us Never molested Go in the wrong Well, farther along We'll know all about it Farther along We'll understand why So cheer up my brothers And live in the sunshine We'll understand it All by and by When death in her black robes Visits our household Leaving our life so Sunless and drear All while there are others Living among us Never molested Year after year Farther along we know all about it. Farther along we understand why. So cheer up, my brothers, and live in the sunshine. Here we'll understand.
Nobody can get no rest in done, it's true. So I spend my time as best I can, thinking big and making plans. Wondering where them trains are rolling to. Lay down your head, poor boy. Feel how the ground does move. Hear how them drivers sing. Everybody knows that's the way it goes. Where was it you lived in case I'm ever there? Well, two doors down and three behind. And it gets a little bit out of hand sometimes. Oh, don't let it fool you into thinking you don't care. But lay down your head and fly. I quietly pass you by You won't even see me go Well, if I thought about it long enough I just might make some kind of move Watchful eyes get too hard on the soap But with a smokehouse just across the way And this fog upon the light of day I'd be hard put coming up with where to go. So lay down on your head, poor boy. Feel how the ground does move. Hear how them drivers sing. What now, my darling one? Go find a little fun. You are not Play one more, Gretchen. Yeah. This one's called uh, Only Him or Me. Autumn days and window panes, God 
God forgive us if you feel deceived. But the clock don't know you like I do. And it's only him or me you got to please. sake of the song.
I'm not the one to tenderly bring for soft sympathy I've just begun to see my way clear and it's plain if I stop I will fall well I can lay down a tear for pain just a tear and that's all What does she want me to do? She says that she knows That moments are rare, I suppose But it's true And then on she goes To say I don't care And she knows that I do Oh, but maybe she just has to sing for the sake of the song and who do I think that I am to decide that she's wrong like to think I was cruel but she knows that's a lie for I would be no more than a two if I allowed her to cry all over me all my sorrow is real even though I can't change my plan She could see how I feel, then I know that she'd understand. And does she actually think I'm to blame? Does she really believe that some word of mine could relieve all her pain? Can't she see that she grieves just because she's been blindly deceived? by her shame oh but maybe she just has to sing for the sake of the song on oh, who do I think that I am to decide that she's wrong nothing's what it seems maybe she'll start someday to realize if she abandons her dreams all she'll have left to live with their lies some people in here with me who've been sitting here the whole time, unable to say a word, and none of them are used to it. Well, let's see. So it's like a song, a new song. I walk 
47 miles of bog wire. I use a cobra snake for a necktie. I got me a house on a roadside made out of rattlesnake hide. Well, I got me a chimney made on top, made out of human skull. Well, come on, take a little walk with me. Tell me, who do you love? Well, who do you love? Oh, who do you love? Well, who do you love? Well, the tombstone set in the graveyard mine. Just 27 and I don't mind. I was blue, and down the alley an ice wagon flew, door bumped open, somebody screamed, you should have heard just what I need, who do you love, who do you love, who do you love, who do you love, and Arlene took me by my hand. story and I was told it uh, by my father so I'll tell it because it's kind of interesting uh, this happened when uh, let's see it's my grandfather and uh, my great uncle lived together on on this farm by Fort Worth Texas and uh, my grandmother too and uh, my grand my great uncle was uh out in the fields doing something, you know, with a mule and pulling up stumps or something like that. And uh, he had an accident, and uh, his arm got caught in the chain and uh, was cut off. And, of course, he passed out, fell down, passed out from lack of blood. And these two guys that had been uh, in the next field over on the next farm kind of looked around after a while, and they saw that he was laying down, and they went over to see what was wrong. And they found him. Right. Took him back to the house, and uh, my my grandfather and my grandmother took him and you know put him put him in bed and cleaned him up. And uh, as the day went on, into night he became delirious and was sitting up in bed, and, uh, real high fever. And he was yelling about his arm, how bad his arm hurt. And uh, they would straighten out, you know, his arm that he had left, his left arm. And uh, he would say, no, it's the other arm. And this went on and on. It was driving my grandfather crazy. Finally, he went out to where the accident happened. And uh, the two guys, after they had taken my great uncle to the house, had gone back by there and caught the mule, you know, and brought it back and buried my great uncle's arm. And uh, my grandfather saw where they where they'd buried it. And uh, he dug it up. And uh, turned out when they buried it, they buried it with uh, the wrist and 
you know, a real bent back position. So my grandfather straightened it out, reburied it, went back to the house and asked uh, my grandmother how uh, my great uncle was. <laughs> and uh, she said, well, it's really strange. About 10 minutes ago, he just jumped up in bed and said, thanks very much, feels much better. I went back and, and he's been sleeping uh, peacefully since, which is a, a stone true story. which just goes to show. I wouldn't tell it if it wasn't a true story. Because it sure ain't a funny story. <laughs> it's called uh, Mr. Mud and Mr. Gold. King of clubs awoke, and it was to his queen he turned, his lips were laughing as they spoke, his eyes like bullets burned, the sun's upon a gambling day, his queen she just smiled blissfully, let's make some wretched fool to pay, plain it was she did agree, he sent his deuce down into diamond, his sport a heart and his trade a spade, Three kings with the legions come, preparations soon were made. They voted club the day's commander, they give him an army face and number, all but the outlaw jack of diamonds and the aces in the sky. Now he give his sevens first instruction, Spirit me a game of studs, stakes unscarred by limitation between a man named Gold and a man named Mud. And club filled Gold with greedy vapors till his long green eyes did glow, and Mud was left with the sighs and trembles, watching his hard earned money go. Flushes fell on Gold like water, and tens it paired and paired again. But the aces only flew through heaven, and the diamond jack called no man friend. Now the Diamond Queen saw Mud's ordeal, began to think of her long lost son, fell to her knees with a mother's mercy, prayed to the angels, everyone. Now the Diamond Queen, she prayed and prayed, and the Diamond Angel filled Mud's hole, and the wicked King of Clubs himself fell face down in front of gold. Now three kings come to Clubs' command, but the angel from the sky did ride. Three kings up on the streets of gold, three fireballs on the muddy side. Now the club queen heard her husband's call, but Lord, that queen of diamonds joy, when the outlaw in the heavenly hall turned out to be her wandering boy. Now mud he checked and gold bet all, and mud he raised and gold did call, and the smile just melted off his face when mud turned over that diamond ace. Now here's what this story is told. If you feel like mud, you'll end up gold. You feel like lost, you'll end up found. So amigo, lay them raises down. <clears throat> spoken like someone who's played a lot. Spoken like someone who's played a lot of uh, penny ante poker in motel rooms. With the bass player, it wasn't Penny Ante. We got to where we were Ante in like eight dollars a game, because we were in North Carolina, and his money was my money, and my money was his money. I won one night. I won two hundred and fifty dollars and fired him. And that's the last time I seen him. You're mean. Man. Well, play another.
It's quarters on the line. You're receiving their strict orders from the station just behind. Now George's mother come to him with a bucket on her arm. Saying, my darling boy, you be careful how you run. Well, it's many a man has lost his life in trying to make lost time. Oh, but if you run your engine right, you can make her just on time. To the rock she crashed And the engine she laid upside down Georgie's breast was smashed And his head lay against the firebox door And the flames were rolling high Well, I'm proud to be born for an engineer On the sea and no road to die
baby, someday you're gonna hurt me. I've been hurt in love before. Only God can know, and time alone will tell. But in the meantime, I'll keep loving you with all my heart and soul. And pray God to let it last if it's His will. So don't be angry with me, darling, if I fail to understand. All your little whims and wishes all the time. I'm dumb, I guess, like any foolish man. And my head stays kind of foggy because you're mine. Nice song. A song called Who Lives to Fly. She had 20 years Where she turned 
mother saying mother I know that you'll grieve but I've given my soul to St. John the gambler tomorrow comes time to leave the hills cannot hold back my sorrow forever dead men lie deep round the door of the only salvation that's mine for the asking some other thing on me no more and winter downhill steadily. You don't mean fledglings? What? Fledglings? <laughs> no, not the birds. The things that are... That are Motels? <laughs> Maybe there's not a name for them. For what? Well, <clears throat> it was uh, a little, uh, almost like a patio built onto the end of this motel, except much smaller than a patio. And instead of a place for people to stand or sit, there were little greeneries growing, but it wasn't a garden. Portico? Maybe a portico. That sound, that sound, that sounds like it looked. That sound, sound, that sounds like it looked. <laughs> well, I played the song that I wrote, wow. 
in the Santa Portico. The birds were going birds downhill. Were going <laughs> Hello. 